Spatial Computing Company, Hadean, have been awarded competitive funding by the Defense and Security Accelerator, DASA, to develop and scale a complex and representative synthetic human terrain for British Army simulations. This will take the form of a contract with the Defense Science and Technology Laboratory, DSTL. The project aims to enhance military training in land environments by populating scenarios with meaningful, pattern-of-life, behaviors and services, such as local leaders, military, government agencies, NGOs, media and industry. This capability, implemented as part of the Hadean AI-powered spatial computing platform, represented as a real-time social media hub within the LVC, live, virtual, and constructive, environments, will seamlessly integrate AI models to deliver a configurable and consistent representation of A3E behaviors, audiences, actors, adversaries, and enemies. Supported by a large language model, LLM, at its core, it will use AI to understand the evolving context during an LVC training exercise, causing the simulated A3ES to respond dynamically to the details of the actions of the trainees. These in turn will cause reactions and prompt training personnel to adjust their approach and tactics, effectively bridging the physical and virtual worlds through real-time interactions. Hadean CEO, Craig Beddis, said, exploiting novel technologies, like generative AI, at the speed of relevance and transforming them into new capabilities for the end user is at the center of what agile SMEs have to deliver. This is a great milestone for Hadean as we continue to innovate at the disruptive edge of defense technology, forging our spatial compute technology into a decision support tool that offers credible and quality advice and helps generate decision advantage for the military and government leaders. Secure by design and interoperable, the social media tool will be able to integrate with both current and novel training systems to enhance their potential for impactful training. In combination with AI-powered data exploitation capabilities, it will also generate an after-action review dashboard to help commanders identify weak points and improve their future performance. This competition is funded by the British Army in support of the Army Collective Training System, ACTS, and represents Hadean's continued direct-to-government engagement in support of the program. It builds on the recent delivery of a Pathfinder contract which helped validate a spatial compute platform approach for the Army by developing a cloud-native simulation and deploying it in an austere environment in Kenya to support LVC training operations and after-action reviews. Development is set to begin this winter and is scheduled to be completed in 2024.